Hello and welcome to Andritz Separation. Today we're going to talk about how to double the liquid capacity and enhance flexibility with the revolutionary Andritz prefiltration technology for pusher centrifuges. Let's have a look at some basics. This is a standard single-stage pusher centrifuge. The suspension is fed to the centrifuge continuously. The solid cake is formed in the main filtration zone, which is located in front of the pusher plate. The filtrate leaves the machine and the solid cake is left behind. The cake is then pushed together by the pusher plate and thus moved forward at the same time. The main filtration zone, which is responsible for over 70% of the filtration effect, is of particular interest. Let's take a closer look. The pusher plate is in position at the far left. Thus, the suspension only encounters existing filter cake. This cake has been pushed together to form a solid mass, so very little filtrate can pass through it. The pusher plate now moves towards the right, thus opening up the main filtration zone. More and more suspension lands directly on the free filter medium, causing the filtration rate to rise continuously. While the filtrate is removed by the centrifugal force, the solids remain in the basket. This is how the filter cake is formed. The pusher plate has arrived at its far right position and the moment of maximum filtration is reached. The pusher plate now changes direction. Now there is no free screen area in the main filtration zone. The screen is covered with a thin layer of solid cake. This solid cake is pushed together by the pusher plate and compressed more and more as this happens. The filtration rate is reduced continuously as a result. As soon as the pusher plate reaches its far left position, the whole cycle starts over again. Due to the constant change between minimum and maximum filtration, a conventional design of pusher centrifuge achieves an average filtration rate of 50% of the maximal filtration rate. What makes the Krauss Mafi pusher centrifuge with prefiltration technology different? First of all, the pusher plate is stationary. It is our prefiltration stage that moves instead. It is shown here in the far left position. It is covered with a thin, uncompressed layer of solid cake. This allows a maximum filtration rate in the prefiltration zone, which is marked here in green. The prefiltration stage now moves to the right and is cleaned by the stationary pusher plate. It offers the suspension entering the centrifuge less and less filtration surface, and its share of the overall filtration effect decreases. The cake falling down from the prefiltration stage is not compressed and does not obstruct filtration. At the same time, more and more of the main filtration zone is now accessible and its share of the overall filtration increases accordingly. As soon as the prefiltration stage reaches its far right position, the process reverses. The prefiltration stage pushes the cake out of the main filtration zone and compresses it at the same time. As a result, the decreasing filtration rate in the main filtration zone is compensated by the increasing filtration rate in the prefiltration zone. There is always a free filtration surface available, and a maximum filtration rate is guaranteed at all times. The Krauss Maffei Pusher Centrifuge with prefiltration technology thus succeeds in doubling the filtration rate and hence also the liquid capacity. This makes the Krauss Maffei Pusher Centrifuge with Andritz prefiltration technology much more flexible in operation.